This is the view southeast across the Brisbane River. If you follow the highway from the bridge, it leads towards a flat topped mountain in the distance. This is Mount Tambourine, our starting point for the day. Picking the launch wasn't the easiest choice and some went to Beachmont, the east facing site, but we anticipated an improving trend at Tambo. When we first arrived, the windsock was pointing downhill. Not a good sign. Andrew and I followed Matt, who'd found a thermal out the front. Yeah. I was flying Felipe's prototype wing for the first time, and he joined us later on. This is a relief, three out of three getting up. And uh, I believe that's Matt and the Gin Leopard. Andrew, just below me. Not much of a climb here, but we're all sticking with it. Felipe in blue, Hamid in orange, and William who gave me a lift. I was fiddling with my camera, so I lost the gaggle and didn't get to base. But after gliding over here, I got a good climb and started catching up. Cloud base was about 4,000 feet at this stage. Lowest point of the flight here behind Hinchies. It's uh, nice and sunny here, but there's uh, not really. The clouds aren't looking good. It's, it's a blue hole. Philippe's gone uh, to the left. It looks very dark at Beachmont, so I think we made the right decision to go to Tambo. But maybe we can sneak in there high and uh, yeah, just sneak back out again. Where is he? He's just must be behind the wing, yeah. Funky air here at Flying Fox. It feels like the cloud is trying to suck me up, but doesn't really know where it's sucking from. And I think I saw the actual Flying Fox cable before. I can't see it now though. Yeah, it's all pretty burnt out here. Like, it seems like it can sniff out the lift from right. And yeah, it still haven't had any kind of collapse at all today. There was quite a few lumps and bumps to get into this climb. And I was talking about the wedge-tailed eagles and saying the wing was a good combination of nice feedback and low workload. It's just about to turn left before. <laughs> I'm glad that I did my shoulder check because Felipe was right there. Fantastic. We are in the right spot. So flying with the creator of this as yet unnamed wing. found a good one, one glide away from the fort, having just come from down that way. Oh, this is amazing. I've neglected now and it's just going off. Big cloud here. Uh, this is the nominated turnaround point. Back on this line of convergence, it's just so amazing. Find me up beside a wall of cloud. Felipe and uh, Hummus with us again. Well, actually, for the first time, really. Although Felipe was flying with them earlier in the flight. Yeah, we're at over 6,000 feet. Just cruising. What a freaking amazing day. Uh, sorry, Phil, I can't hear you. Just a long glide. Hammer's behind me and the lift in front. Yeah, it's kind of a different world down here. So, O'Reilly's Valley. Eagle, man. It, unannounced, it just made contact with the wing. I don't Chill out. 
So this is what the sky looked like from Brisbane when we were coming back in that convergence line. A perfect day if you could get to those clouds. Light winds and the cloud suck and shadows organising lift a very special flight.